So, Anya, you're here from Scraper Wiki at the News Rewired conference. Now, just explain to me a little bit about what Scraper Wiki is. Scraper Wiki is an internet platform that allows developers to scrape, store, aggregate, and visualize, visualize predominantly public data. There's quite a big move across the world, the UK is leading in this area, to release a large amount of public data in, 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 in to release a large amount of public data and make it available for people for analysis. The problem with a lot of this information is that it's on websites and it can't be used. You can't do anything with it. What Scraper Wiki allows developers to do is to take that data, scrape it, and put it into a usable format that, and then download it to make it easy for people to, to analyze that data. You're making life easier for journalists. And about the yes, I mean, one of the, uh, in the media industry specifically, there's a move towards data-driven journalism and computer system reporting. And in fact, an economist had uh, analysis in the Economist that was saying that uh, data is the new plastic. So, and one of the industries that's moving faster than any other is the media industry. So, for journalists, our tool is particularly useful because it, it's it's an aid for them uh, to make life easier. So, we we're what we'd like to do is to hook journalists up with developers, get them collaborating together in order to help them get at this public data that's becoming available. And maybe we could speak to, um, to Francis, your, uh, Francis Irvin, your senior developer at Scraper Wiki. Um, just explain to me how, how it's, made. it's kind of an online community, really. Would that be, would that be fair? Yeah, it's a community for people who are writing computer code. So just as Wikipedia, like so anyone edit an encyclopedia article and... Um, share doing that and do that collaboratively. Scraper Wiki lets people edit edit program code collaboratively. So it's much easier to do, you don't have to install anything on your computer, you can just use a web browser and, and, and program to write scripts that extract the data from the site and convert it and do things to it. So what 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 can a um what can a journalist hope to get? You know, if they come to Scraper Wiki, what can they hope to So there are probably two kinds of journalists. So if, if they're one who isn't interested in learning to program or learning tech, per se, then they can request a data set. So there's a community of people who will watch the data sets and make them when they're requested, or you can pay someone to have a data set made. Um, so then a programmer will go and do the screen scraping for you, and then all you need to do is download a CSV file. The what is the programmer getting out of this? Because normally you know you would pay for programmers to, to do this kind of work. Surely programmers would want to be paid. Oh well, so, yeah. I mean, some will want to be paid. Some will be uh, people who are themselves systems journalists, in a way, but with programming skills, and they will want to contribute and find information to, in order to show what's to show what's going on and find the find the story. Right. So there's in, increasingly the, 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 the idea of journalism being collaborative with, with with the users. Some of your readers can be very technical. You might want to help. Yes. Right. But then it's also it's also if, if something's just too big or too hard or no one is going to do it free, then you can also pay people to do it. And and Anya, I'm right in saying that you've got some events coming up where where journalists and uh, programmers can join together in yes. hack days. When, when are they? Well, we're calling it the Hacks and Hackers Hack Day. Uh, we ran a very successful event in January in London. We had it at Channel Four. We're running another event in Liverpool on the 13th of July, uh, where we're putting 25 uh, developers and 25 journalists together in order to create projects in one single day and hopefully have some of those projects published by someone at the end after the event. We're running, we're hoping to run an event in Birmingham on the 23rd of July and uh, we're planning to roll it out to Cardiff, Manchester, Leeds, Edinburgh and finally Belfast and, and last, by no means least, my hometown Dublin. Right, so, you're everywhere. <laughs> you really are everywhere. We really want to right. try it. It's, yes, we think it's people who are receptive to the idea of the media industry seems very warm. We're getting a lot of support from different uh, media players, so we think it'll be successful. So we can follow progress on the Scraper Wiki, there must be a we blog. We can, on our sure blog, blog, blog that's Excellent, everything covered. Thank everything you very much. Covered. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you very much, Angelique. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.